My voice agent uh, sent me an appointment to uh, read for the uh, voice of Yoda. Really? Yoda? Uh, voice of Yoda. And uh, I got to the uh, uh, office up there, and I, they gave me the, some of the material, and I read it over. And then I auditioned for it. And they liked my audition, but I didn't get the job. Frank Oz got the job. He's a, he's a real voice actor. Yeah. And uh, he, he was perfect perfect for Yoda. Anyway, they did like my reading, and at that time they needed to have the original actor who played Boba replaced because he was an Englishman and he had a very, very British voice. And that was, was Alan Harrison? That was, that was uh, Jeremy Bullock. Oh, okay, Jeremy, Jeremy Bullock, Bullock, yeah, you're right. Played the role of Boba well, Fett. Fett. He, yeah, he know, he did yeah. all the stuff. So, um, it wasn't, his voice was not that for a bounty hunter. Yeah. They needed someone whose voice was a bounty hunter voice, yeah. you see. So I read it. I read it for them, and they said, good. Tomorrow, they sent me down to a sound stage in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. that's, where we, that's where it was done, our sound stage. I parked there at the stage door. I went in. I met uh, Gary Kurtz, the producer. Uh, I've been Kirshner, the director of the Empire, Empire Strikes Back. Back, and we spoke for a few minutes, and then they showed me on a screen the the footage of the uh, scenes that I was mm -hmm. going to uh, do the voice for. So I could, uh, I said, I didn't have to lip sync because there's <laughs> there's nothing. <laughs> there's, he's he's wearing a mask. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're, it was a pretty easy job. <laughs> easy job. <laughs> so. Uh, uh, Kirshner gave me a point or two that he wanted me to change on the reading, and then uh, and then we uh, and we shot it, and we recorded it. I would say seven minutes of work. Wow! Totally seven minutes to do it all, and then uh, it was then I was finished. So then Gary Kurtz uh, took me by the arm and lead me to my car, which was parked just outside of the uh, of the stage of the, of the sound stage. But there was a dark room between where we were and the stage door, uh -huh. and there was a man sitting in the dark room, and uh, Gary Kurtz led me up to where this man was sitting, and he said, uh, Jason, uh, this, this, is, uh, this is George Lucas. Oh. So, um, um, he didn't get up and shake hands. Or, uh, he was just in the dark? He was in the dark. Oh, man, that's kind of weird. And so, and I stood there. And I said I had to had to say something. Uh huh. So I said I don't believe we've ever met. And George Lucas said, No, but I know Boba Fett. And you're Boba Fett. That's all. <laughs> so then, so then my uh, then Gary Kurtz grabbed me by the arm and he and he pulled me over to the stage door and to my to my car. And I stood out there and I said. Now what did he mean? Did he when he said I know Boba Fett? Does he mean I know Boba Fett and 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 you not you're not it, or I know Boba Fett and you really nailed it? <laughs> I think you nailed it. I think he was pretty happy. I think I nailed it because that's my voice on. <laughs> no question about it. So that's wow. the story. That's how I got the job. That's a great story.